Hi guys, um, welcome to my channel. This is a very special reading. Oh, well, not very. I mean, it is a reading. <laughs> okay. Um, um, with regards to the full moon that we're having. Okay, so I'm not really working on the full moon in Scorpio, but I, uh, you know, um, but I am working with the vibration. Okay, so with this reading, um, my intention that I'm putting for fire sign is the dreams of love. Okay, um. The dream of love in the sense that um, you know there are dreams that are worth risking for so I'm not giving this a sugar-coated reading but this is about a, a reading on um, if I said fire sign this is an intro for all this all these objects okay this reading is based upon on is it worth to stay on this dream or can we move on forward in accept it as it was something that is magical and it was a dream for love for us to love to connect with this person or to whoever that we have okay you know this dream can be like something that we have already resonated with it has already happened but we're still dreaming on about it okay um, it can also show us uh you know deeper underlying messages as far as the dream because i'm using the major arcana okay as the crowning energy of the dream or the vision okay because I, i'm not focusing on the dream energy itself because like you know some people don't recall their dream but this is about your 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 um idea of that energy that you're connecting with that person through this cycle of the moon okay so that is gonna be the um intro also and um thank you very much for donating to gofundme and that is one part of our dream <laughs> okay <laughs> of my dream and your dream as well whoever has donated thank you very much and for the membership there is still a promo until the 12 and then so do sign up and i will see you guys there now here it is for each um elements by the zodiac okay hi water sign welcome to my channel oh i think we did the intro already sorry there's the intro and now this is for the water sign okay so we're gonna start with the cancer scorpio pisces okay <laughs> thank you very much to the water sign who i feel closely so i mean i know i have i think that is the most least i have um in my chart i think and that's why i love water signs so dear <laughs> they keep me where i am supposed to be <laughs> with love and care <laughs> okay i don't know because uh you know can't be with the fire sign too much like me we do care but not as deep as you guys <laughs> okay so we're gonna have this reading now for the water sign first with the cancer major kind of let's see what is the crowning energy for this full moon for you guys you have here the emperor Okay, understanding what is just and what is for you shall be yours. Okay, it is also understanding all the elements and making, uh, you know, the decision afterwards. You can be um, feeling connected to everyone and finally understanding, you know, having an epiphany. is like, oh, that's what this person wants and oh, what, that's what this person needs. Okay, a lot of understanding energy with this emperor. They are also the executioner. Okay, it says an action card, and as a cancer, I'm not sure if you guys, you know, I'm an ex executioner, but this is an energy that is asking of you to hold on it and execute it. This understanding now requires action, you know, movement. Okay, so for the cancer, let me see what is now. Okay, for the cards. Okay, ooh. Action with regards to Ten of Pentacles over here, okay? To strongly manifest, ground that relationship, okay? Or even asking, I know, doesn't sound well, but, you know, own it. I don't know why. Is it someone taking it away from you, concerns? But own it, grab onto it, hold on to it, okay? Um, can be a fire sign or an earth sign that you're connecting here. Um, because it's like, you know, this was given to you, okay, strongly through... You know, you have Prince of Wands, Prince of Cu Princess of Cups over here through gift. Like this is, you felt that this person is a gift from whoever, you know, up there that you feel you connect with. So this is a very blessed connection that you have with the water, earth, or fire that you see here. This person has a lot of energy. Okay, Seven of Wands, but there has been some resistance. So it's a lot of uh, resistance through conviction and you're the one who's doing it cancer it's not the other person i see here at night like you are resisting the connection or you're in denial of this 
level of connection of this earth sign who has been very slow connecting with you and who has been trying to juggle the situation with you. You felt that through finding, you know, you put yourself in a bubble, Cancer, that you don't want to, you're scared. I'm not sure why you're scared. Let me see. Okay, you're scared of how fast it will go and that things can go through the distance. So there's a level of hesitation because um, it's, you know, it can be a fire sign. This, the how swift it is manifesting, it puts you into the shock. So you are in a shock. That's why you are asking to take action. Okay, meaning to go in reverse. You know, it, it, I think it's okay from the cards. Okay, so that's what it's showing here. It's okay to go in reverse. Sometimes you can swim against the green and you learn something new. Okay, so now let's see what is going on for the Scorpios, which is full moon in Scorpio. That's why we have this reading also. So let me see what's going on for the major arcana for the Scorpios. Ooh, you have here the chariot, which is a Cancer card. Okay. Um, let me see what we're going to have here. Okay. You have here Cancer. Oh, sorry. <laughs> the chariot. Okay. It, this one is putting things into control. Okay. Understanding how to move in a direction. Um, but when you understand uh, how to move in a direction, meaning there was good and bad of the situation, or this is an energy where um, you have complete control of everything in your life now, Scorpio, and you can charge your way towards a new love, a new connection, okay, can be, okay, so that's what I'm sensing here. But this, uh, this horse here, this chariot, is not even two kinds of color. This is about making both colors sync in together so that's a good energy meaning you really have total control if you can change even the color of this chart into one but basically you're becoming one with yourself and going in a direction that's what i'm seeing here for the scorpio okay let me see oh yeah becoming one elimination over here sun card you are blessed you are given a new opportunity this is coming to everything like you know this is like an awakening of someone that you love that you care it can be a fire sign over here okay and through patiently waiting for pentacles the power of connecting by not connecting you, un you will understand that um, pen uh, um by uh, scorpio because you have manifested this um by patiently waiting and not taking action um five of swords and surrender okay this is five of swords is you know the war is over you know time to Time to analyze the situation, okay? That's what I'm sensing here. It's not Four of Swords, yes. But this Five of Swords is about defeat. But for anyone to accept defeat, they have more control of the situation. Because defeat is not... E it's easy to accept being a winner. Try accepting defeat. That shows power, okay? So let's see what's, what's next here. Okay, King of Cups can be a water sign, okay? That you have here, okay? But I'm sensing here this is uh, this is a this other water sign has already been in the past. Okay, you have your two of ones. Um, you're just thinking of them. Yes, from a distance. Nine of cups. Um, you could you there is a sense of um, ne uh, neglect and at the same time missing this water sign. Um, but a new beginning is already happening in your life, Scorpio. And you just need to focus. Two of swords. Okay, because I think this is this fire sign is the one that you are now feeling destiny with. There was destiny with another water sign strongly, but now there is a fire sign that is just there, waiting, waiting. Okay, so let's see what's going on now for the Pisceans. Pisceans, what's going on with the Pisceans? You have here the magician. A lot of action card in this full moon. Okay, the magician here, okay, it's almost the same thing as an emperor, but a different way, okay, emperor is just, the magician can, can have its duality, Pisceans, okay, just through understanding your, your strength, your will, your courage, your power, all together, that you can do anything that you want, this is also the, you know, number one card, it is about the I, Meaning, you have to think of a situation about yourself, okay? And what do you really want? What is it about this connection? But it has to be first you. The priority, Pisceans, is you, okay? This magician wields its strength, its power from its natural source, which would be our center. 
So it's asking you in your center, okay, for manifesting love and communicating with this person, establishing connection. Yes, you can, but you have to prioritize yourself. The magician is about an action card, okay? You have here King of Wands. Can be a fire sign that you have been thinking, okay? Um, let me see. And you, oh, yep, past relationship, six, six of cups over here. You guys were happy before with this fire sign. And you're waiting, hangman, okay? Allowing everything, looking at things on how it was. Yep, definitely how it was, princess of cups. There's no more energy moving here. This is belong in the past. And yeah, yeah. This is about a rebirth, a new you. So the death of the relationship is a new you, Pisces. I think the fire sign has already moved on. They're not looking at you in this direction anymore. So it's about you, you. This is a phoenix over here. I know you're not a fire sign, but it's a rebirth. Okay, allow, you have allowed it. That's why you have this control now. Okay, and you're looking at it of what it was. It was what it was, but it's now a new you. Let me see what's gonna happen in this new year. Okay, they're asking me to get it in the middle. Ah, Prince of Wands. Maybe another fire sign coming your way. They're just there. Up, oh, offering emotion, Ace of Cups. Told you there's another fire sign. So the fire sign can have passed already, but there's a new one coming towards your way. Alright, so for the Pisceans, that is gonna be it. Thank you very much, guys, for watching this special brought to you by the people who donated to the GoFundMe. Thank you very much, guys. Bye.